last month, I gave my inaugural award for the most startling statistic that I have seen to Linden. This month, Roselle Park, congratulations. You are the winner of a statistic that just blew my mind. So I'm going to get into that number and much more right after this. Hi, my name is Camille Haynes. I'm a local real estate agent in the Union County, New Jersey area. As always, I wanna thank you for taking a moment out of your day to watch my video on Roselle Park's real estate housing market for October, 2022. I wanna preface this. Um, you know, I've been recording videos for a little while. You know, we're family. I hope you get a vibe of how I am, how I operate. So I am gonna be cussing in this video. If you do not like to hear expletives, or if you're in an area where you cannot hear expletives, I'm asking please fast forward about two minutes or so because I will be cussing starting about five seconds. Um, so let's go ahead and get into this. Last, um, in the past month or two, I've seen statistics that have really just blown my mind. I don't know where the numbers come from and I try to research it. So, you know, when I'm going through all of these towns and I'm looking at my sheets and I'm reviewing what the numbers are, now, you know, there's a number that honestly I'm like, oh shit, like where did this number come from? Like, am, is this, am I reading this wrong? Like, I'm like, legit, am I reading this wrong? And, you know, this Last month, actually, let me go back two months ago before I started giving the Oh Shit Award. So I'm actually calling it, yeah, so let, let me go back and tell you. I'm going to call it the Oh Shit Stat of the Month. So let, two months ago, I should have gave it to Rawway for the lack of inventory in town that just blew my mind. Last month, which was the actual inaugural award recipient, that was for Linden. And I gave that award because their sales prices just went crazy. Average sales price went crazy um, in the month of September. But in the month of October, congratulations, Roselle Park, because you guys are the winner of the Oh Shit Stat of the Month. This is the number I looked at. I legit did. I was like, oh shit, where did that number come from? So I'm going to go over what that number is in a second. And the Oh shit, stat of the month. Let's go ahead and talk about this. Um, you know, I've been for the past couple of months talking about an inventory issue for Roselle Park and a couple of other surrounding um, towns. And so, you know, when I saw this number, it definitely, it, it did. It, I, was, I was blown away by it. And that number is for the statistic of the number of new listings or new homes that came on the market in the month of October. So let's go ahead and play a little guessing game. I'm going to give you four options. You tell me what number you think it is. So how many new homes came on the month of October in Roselle Park? Option number one, five. Option number two, 23. Option number three, three. And option number four, 31. So I gave you four numbers and I'm gonna let you think about it for a couple seconds. And I'm gonna say, if you guess number one, you're wrong. It's actually worse than that. It was number three. So there were only three homes that came on the month in the, uh, came on in the month of October in Roselle Park. And I do not know why, you, you, for real, legit. If you're a homeowner, Roselle Park, and you thought about selling your house, you did not. Let me know why you didn't. Or if you, you know, why are, you, why are people not selling their homes in town? Only three listings the entire month. Blew me away. Uh, l let's just say for comparison's sake, last year, there were 14 homes that came on the market. So that's a decline of approximately, what, 70 some odd? Yes, 72%. I 
no, excuse me, 11 homes came on the market in the month of October, 72% difference. This month, only three homes. If you're a home buyer, you probably noticed something is amiss. You're looking in Roselle Park, checking daily, checking daily. There's nothing coming on, nothing coming on, nothing coming on, nothing coming on. Like, it's crazy. So I would love to get your feedback. And I'd like to congratulate Roselle Park for winning the oh shit stat of the month for not having any new homes come on the market in the month of October. Jeez. <laughs> And of course, whenever you have no new listings coming on the market, the overall inventory will take a hit as well. I'm actually surprised it did not take as much of a hit as what I was expecting it to. Um, last month, 19 homes were available for sale in the month in Roselle Park. Last year, so October 2021, that number was 25. This month, October 2022, it was 17. So it's not as drastic because of the number of homes that did not come on the market or did did not come on the market. Um, it's not as drastic what I expected it to be, but nevertheless, you know, it is still down a little bit from one year ago. And the last thing I want to talk about is pricing. The average sales price of a home in town was $455,000. This is up 12% from one year ago. Even the percentage a house received above asking was a solid number. Homes on average sold 4.9% above their ask amount. This was the second highest number in the county. Roselle, Roselle, excuse me, Roselle was the number one town um, for the month of October. And there you have it. Just a couple of key numbers of what's going on in Roselle Park for October 2022 in the housing market. If you need any assistance or have any questions about your own personal home buying or selling journey, please feel free to reach out to me. I would love to help you out. Make sure you also subscribe to my YouTube channel so you get notified every time I drop a video like this one. And you saw that paper I was reading off of before. If you want a copy of that paper for yourself to review st the monthly statistics, Make sure there's a link below that you can check out and sign up um, so you can get that dropped in your email box every month. Otherwise, guys, I hope you have a great day, week, and I definitely look forward to speaking to you next month. Take care.